Yeah, it's a great day for us. The works on DNS Bridge are now complete. We reopened this week back to uh, two-way traffic and that's really positive. Dennis Bridge was um, originally built 106 years ago and that was the transport link between Bransworth and Ushimua. So that particular structure has served us well. The bridge has been replaced like for like. It's a really successful project after £1.5 million pounds of investment. So I would like to think that we get another um, 100 years from the new construction, yeah. The bridge closed in 2016 following a principal inspection and it was found uh, structurally unsafe. It has been a complex project. There was a number of uh, public utilities crossing the uh, river at the same point as the bridge, so we had to divert those and reroute them. We've worked very closely with the Environment Agency and also other interested parties to replace the bridge deck. Fortunately, we were able to use the abutment, so that's really made the project a lot easier than it could have been. But also, we were hampered by severe weather early in the year. February and March, we had severe storms, uh, rain and heavy snow, so that, so that did delay the project a little bit. During the construction of the works here, there has been some disruption to to uh, local businesses, local residents and also the travelling public so we'd really like to thank all of those for the patience whilst we constructed the job. We do have the clean-up operation, uh, remove the stone that was used on the temporary Bailey Bridge, um, remove the temporary abutments and also clean up the site and remove the compound. It will take a few weeks and months yet to complete the rest of the works but as I said the, the bridge is now open for both vehicle and pedestrian traffic.